Perpetual Mommy here today to do a super, super exciting unboxing slash first look video for all of you. Now this box is open. It is from Jujubee. It contains the new Jujubee and Hello Kitty collaboration print, Hello Rainbow. And it is so cute from what I've seen in photos. Now I did have my husband take all the plastic off these bags. So they are in the box, they are open, but I haven't really looked at them yet because I wanted to get a real first look with you guys without hearing all that crunching and crinkling of the plastic. So hubby went above and beyond and pulled off all the stuff for me. One of the bags, the mini helix that's in here, also has the plastic taken off the zipper pulls so we can take a nice close up look of the zipper pulls as well because I'm so excited to see how they have changed. So without further ado, you guys, let's take a first look at the new Jujube and Hello Kitty collaboration print, Hello Rainbow. Okay, so the first piece out of the box is the mini helix and the mini helix, so cute. So, so cute in this print. Look it, I love it. So we've got Hello Kitty here and there's two Hello Kitties on this print. So there's one Hello Kitty that has the trees on either side of her and I think that maybe on the back side, yep. Then there's a Hello Kitty on the rainbow with the, with the rose, with the flower. And I have to tell you guys, like, I am very much a pastel type girl. Like, I gravitate more towards lights and pastels. And this is a very vibrant, bright color, like old school, original kind of Hello Kitty colors. But it is so fun, and I'm really excited to see the inside because I don't know if you guys were part of it, but we got to vote. Like, they put, GDB put it out to see what color people wanted on the inside. And I think the choices were blue, green, yellow, and there might have been a fourth color. And I voted yellow. And I know it's yellow, but I'm super excited to see the inside and I can kind of see it peeking. Let's take a look. Oh, it's so cute. Oh, it's very bright yellow. Oh, we'll have to take another look in one of the bigger bags so you guys can see, but that is so cute. And while we're in here, the seatbelt strap. strap. For the last couple of the mini helixes for the Toki Doki have been more of like a cotton canvas strap where they've gone back for this print to the seatbelt strap and I definitely prefer the seatbelt strap and look how cute this blue is with this and oh you guys I just noticed look at this the hardware stunning metal GTB hardware but it's black I did not realize that the hardware for hello rainbow was going to be black so look the zipper pulls here are black the hardware here is black let's take a look at the actual hello kitty zipper pull right here let's see here so new font, oh, you got to hear in the box, sorry. New font with the GGB and Hello Kitty. Oh, and the black, look. That is so cute. That is just so cute. Okay, and for you guys, when you get your Hello Rainbow stuff, don't throw your tags away. This is a sticker. I don't know if you guys can see this, but this is a sticker. For you planner mamas out there, your planner dads out there. These would be great things to put in your sticker collection for your planners. Oh my gosh, I am loving this. Let's take a look in here. Oh, look, you've got your little Hello Kitty tag right here on the side. Oh, and there's that nice pop of yellow. Can you guys see the embossing there with Hello Kitty and the bow? And then you have your elasticized pocket in here. I really, really love the mini Helix. I think it's a great little bag. And they also have the one zipper pocket right here. So cute. Let's go ahead and open this back up again. Then inside the mini helix, there is the one elasticized mesh pocket on the inside. And then the back has the slip pocket. This is just such a cute little bag. I love it. Okay, so the next item out of the box is the Hello Rainbow Mini BFF, and super cute again. And what's different about this, one of the first things that you see right away is that the Mini Helix, and let me zip it back up here. The Mini Helix has the little Hello Kitty fabric tag right here with the bow, and the Mini BFF has the actual little Hello Kitty face with the embroidery on it. Loving it. Let's get another nice look at the inside yellow lining. And there it is. That gorgeous yellow pop of color. So cute. And the mini BFF, for those of you who have not seen it before, does have gussets on the sides right here. 
Then on the front right here, we have the mommy pocket. Nice open pocket with the black hardware again. And both the mini Helix and the mini BFF do have one Hello Kitty zipper pull. And this is what it looks like when it comes to, they do a really good job of keeping the zipper pulls, all the kind of the big metal hardware covered in plastic, or it's not really plastic, it's more of like a, I don't know what you would call it. We'll call it thick plastic right now, but it's to protect it. And look, you have your little jewel tone right there. So let's go back and look here again at it so we can get a nice close up shot so you guys can see. I want you guys to get a nice shot of that. I'm just super impressed with this tag. So you got the gem in the middle, you got the script, and then the matte black, which is just so pretty. And I'm getting my fingerprints all over it, but it's just so pretty. But it does come wrapped very, very well and uh, give you a side-by-side -side comparison of these two bags. Now, for those of you who want to know the mini BFF of the three types of mini bags that are out, which is the mini Helix, the mini BFF, and the mini Be Right Back, which I did not get, I think that the mini, B, the mini BFF holds the most. So I've packed them all many, many times, and I do get a much bigger like packing area, at least for me in the way that I pack, inside the mini BFF. Now, for those of you who have been watching my channel for any length of time, you knew that I had to get a B set because I get a B quick and a B set in every print. doesn't matter what it is. If it comes out, I have to have a B quick and a B set. So I am loving how they're doing this with the fabric tag. Like it is just so cute. So this is a nice, you can get nice and tight in here and see just how complimentary it is. It doesn't detract from the pattern at all. And I'm actually feeling the fabric for the first time. So a lot of you ask me when a new kind of print comes out, what does a fabric feel like? And I'll tell you the outside feels like a cross between the um, Rose Quartz and like Tokidoki, the original Tokidoki print, like kind of something in between there. And then the inside is a more of a sateen lining versus like the original Tokidoki, how it was kind of like a more scratchy, substantial feel. This is more of like a silky kind of smooth feel. It has a really nice feel to it. It doesn't feel thin at all. It feels like substantial and sturdy, but it's not a super crunchy laminate, if that makes sense. And then in here, they are still coming out with their, this is the gel pack that comes in there. These, they're still coming with the two straps, the short strap and the long strap, which is amazing. And so for those of you who are new to the B sets, it comes with a large piece, a medium piece, and a small piece. So the large piece and the medium piece both have the big Hello Kitty tag, and then the small set piece has the little bow tag, just like the mini Helix did. And this is just so, so cute. And then these pieces all have that nice yellow pop of lining on the inside, and I am so glad they went with the yellow. Let me pull that so I can pack out. I'm so glad they went with the yellow. It just, I think it's just such a fun color. And I'm surprised at how much I'm really enjoying this because like I said, I'm a pastel girl at heart and this print just makes me want to smile. Like I was so tired before we sat down to record this and I'm just sitting here smiling at this print. Like I cannot wait to run and go grocery shopping tomorrow with this print because it's just like making me legitimately happy. How weird is that? So another one of the bag styles for GGB that I am slowly coming to like feel like I need in every print that comes out is the B Dapper. Now, the B Dapper for me is great for toys, it's great for clothes, it's great for snacks, it's great as like a long, like on the go makeup container. I can't even tell you all the things that I've used for it, but for the most part, we use it for snacks or for toys, but it is so great. I'm gonna open it up so you can see how these open. It's like a wide mouth, and look at this, another pop inside of the color, pop of the color, you guys get a nice shot of this just so great and it, like I said it opens so wide I can fill this with toys with arts and crafts my girls can get into it no problem I can fill it with snacks we can see what's in there it has a grab handle it has the zipper front you have the one zipper pull right here and then you have the main zipper pull to open the main part of the bag and then right here you have the fabric tag so this one doesn't have the Hello Kitty face tag, it has the side bow tag. But they all are coming with the Hello Kitty sticker. So again, do not throw your stickers away, so make sure you keep those. And you guys can see the fabric is not as like traditionally thick and 
I want to say structured or more rigid. You can see it's a little bit more floppy. It's again, it's not thin. It doesn't feel thin. It feels really nice and sturdy, but it is a little bit more slouchy, I guess, than maybe like the old school GGB fabric. So just to let you guys know that um, it does feel a little bit softer. I actually really, really am enjoying how it's feeling. I think it's going to take less room to pack up too when it's not in use, but I just can't get over the inside, you guys. I'm going to give you a nice shot of that. It's just so beautiful. Really quick, I was moving this out of the shot and I didn't even notice this. So this is the one side of the bow tag. Look at the other side. It says GGB. I didn't even notice that. I gotta check the other ones now and see if they are like that too. Let's check the small set piece. Yep, here's the small set piece with the bow and the back side, GGB. So cute. So this is that Be Quick. So I remember I told you guys that I get a B set and a Be Quick in every print. This is the Be Quick. The Be Quick is a really cute bag. And again, we have that nice fabric tag there. I'm not gonna go into a lot of detail, but we have the one zipper pull. And on the inside, we have the long strap. Now what they're doing different that they didn't do before is that the long strap is adjustable. So it's on swivel clips, just like normal. And you do have the adjustability factor here. And then you also have the short strap. So that's really, really nice. And then there's also an internal zippered compartment as well. The Be Quick is great for everything. It's great for changes of clothes. It's great for diapering essentials. This was my favorite bag to use for diapering essentials when my girls were in diapers. It's great as a date purse when you go out with your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your wife, your husband. All right, so this is the bag that I think is gonna make its debut with me tomorrow, grocery shopping. So this is the Mini B, and you've got the fabric tag right here again. The Mini B, for those of you who've never seen it before, does have a magnetic front closure right here. Oh, look at that. That's so cute. The lining is on the inside pocket as well. So one side is the yellow, and the other side is the print. That's really cute. Then you have a top grab handle. You have little bottle pockets on either side. You have the mesh backing and shoulder straps. And then the main compartment. And what's different about this bag than the other ones that we looked at so far is that this one does open with two zipper pulls. So you get two of the Hello Kitty zipper pulls, which are just adorable. And again, I'm loving the black hardware with it. And there's that beautiful yellow. And on the back of the bag, we have that one zipper right here. So you get a nice slip pocket that goes about halfway down the bag. You guys can see where my fingers are right there. This is so cute. So cute. I think that the black hardware really makes the color pop too. So you don't have any distractions. So you've got the color with the black outline and then the hardware has the black on it too. It just all kinds of blends together. It isn't distracting from the print at all. The very last bag I got in this print, you guys, is the Super B. The Super B is Jujubee's largest unstructured tote. I'm going to try to get it all in the frame for you, but it is a really big bag. So let's see here if we can get this all. Let me hold it up for you really quick. Let's get the tag out of the way. So this is the Super B. So for those of you who are unfamiliar with the Super B, it's an unstructured tote. You have three pockets in the front that go all the way to the bottom of the bag. One, two, three. And again, they go all the way to the very bottom of the bag. I'm going to stick my hand in here so you can see my fingers. The back side of the bag has one pocket, one giant slip pocket that closes with a magnet. It's a really nice, strong magnet. And then the Super B opens with one zipper pull. And it opens to these, this beautiful tote bag. I love these bags for beach days. I love them for picnics. I love them for long car trips. I love them for when I'm going somewhere all day just for myself and I have to carry a bunch of stuff with me. They are so fantastic. You can stuff them full or you can leave them nice and slouchy. You do get one nice zippered pocket along the back side right here is a nice generous zippered pocket and this internal lining you guys I am not a yellow girl but this is the most gorgeous color of yellow I, I can't even tell you like I hope it's coming through on camera 
it's just so beautiful. Then you have the two mesh pockets, mesh slip pockets right here, and then the leash that has the swivel clip. The other thing about this too, is I wanna show you really quick, is the tote handles. The drop length on the Super V is very nice. I'm five foot three, it hits me in a really good spot. I don't have any problem with it. And both sides of the tote handles I wanted to show you guys is in the same fabric print. So cute, but I'm gonna go ahead and put this right here and let you get a nice look at the whole print. Well, that's it for me, you guys. Thank you so much for being here for this first look with me. And like I said to you guys, I am really a pastel kind of girl. I'm not a primary color kind of girl, but this print just is making me smile. I don't know if it's the yellow. I don't know what it is about it, but I can't stop grinning while I'm looking at it. And it's like 1.30 in the morning here, and I'm just sitting here recording and smiling from ear to ear. So I hope that you love it as much that I as I do. And the pictures don't do it justice, you guys. Stay tuned. This video is ending, but I am going to insert some pictures at the end here of these bags and natural lights. I want you to be able to see the colors in natural light so you can see what they look like outside, get a real true representation of the colors. But ask me any questions. I'd love to hear from you. Leave me a comment below. I'll get back to any of you who get to me. Again, I hope you enjoyed this first look. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you've been here before, welcome back. If you like what I'm doing, please go ahead and give me a big thumbs up. I'll talk to you all soon. Bye-bye.